Welcome back, my name is Fat Piku. The game is you say last time. <clears throat> we I'm having a brain fart. Last time we dealt with the ghost ship, right. And uh helped Captain Reed pass on peacefully, got a flame gem for Kathleen, which I need to give her. Recently captured a new Picard, but randomly most immediately want to keep it here. Come help. I'm trying to make baby clothes for a baby, but I'm in a bit of trouble. Can't I don't have all the materials. Should have what you need. Another monster on this island I consider my nemesis besides Oceanus. He doesn't show up very often, but I saw a rear its ugly head recently. Speak to me for more details. Okay, so I think I have all the materials for the baby clothes request already. Aha, there you are. Thank you, now I can finish up the clothes for the baby. Alright, time to get to work. So, Ed took over tailoring the baby clothes that Allison had started making. With his skilled hands, he finished his work in no time. Mm-hmm, <laughs> what a nice outfit. Looks great on him. <laughs> That's right, and they're so cute too. <laughs> oh, darling. By the way, the color red is a symbol of good luck to us. A better color to remember you by, Adol. Yes, we want our son to grow up brave and strong, just like you. Also, Allison and I have been talking, and we've come to a decision. May I, Allison? Yes, of course. All right. Adol. Adol, would you? Do us the honor of being our son's godfather and naming him? I know this is a big deal and a tough decision to make. But you're our saver, Adol. You saved my family. So, I want you to name him. I want that too. Ah, uh, thank you. Thank you so much, Adol. Oh, do you already have a name in mind? Luke. <laughs> That's an excellent name. Yes, it really is. I think he likes that name too. Yes, do you like it too, Luke? The light of Castaway Village. I'm so thankful that Adol feels the same way about our son as we do. Yes, I've never felt so happy before. Thank you so much for naming him, Adel. I'm so grateful for all you've done. Thank you very much. Please continue to watch over us and Luke. That's one down. Red Baby 1C complete. Adds approval increased. Feather boots obtained. Now, them there feather boots. Are they equipment? Or evade rate plus five, move speed plus fifteen. I see, I see. Now then, Kathleen, I have a gift for you. Ah, you found another flamestone for me. I'll put it into the forge at once. How can I help you today? And require essence stones, Leave huh? It Whew, it's complete. Warpal blade. Try to hit the long sword with power comparable to siege weaponry. Leave it to me. Whew, it's complete. Gore's fencer. It's shining golden blade can pierce even the thickest carapace. Leave it to me. Whew, it's complete. Lustria. Eternian crescent blades that shine with radiant wisdom. You want a lot of thunder claws, don't you? Hmm. Leave it to me. Whew, it's complete. 
Rakasha clubs. A nerving combination of innocent and ferocity. Hmm. I'll get started. Whew, it's complete. All right. How can I help you today? Ideally, I'd get bank guards for everyone, but I have nowhere near the resources. Only make one, huh? Leave it to me. All right, finished. Leave it to me. All right, finished. Hmm. Leave it to me. Need Saurian scales. Ancient bones. That is. All right. Now then, I have tomato seeds, if I recall correctly. Good. Very good indeed. Hey, got a minute at all? So basically, one of the pickards ran away. One of the newer ones. I don't think it was used to the village yet. I need to capture it before it leaves the village. Can you help me? Any idea where it went? Well, I've searched all over. It's really good at hiding. Well, it's been spotted a few times, so I'm sure it's still in the village somewhere. If I had to guess, it's hiding in a place where people don't often go. Leave it to me. Really? <laughs> Alright, if you're helping, this will ta get taken care of in no time. Once you capture it, bring it back here. I'm counting on you. Hmm. Hmm. Karina is such an innocent girl. Watching her make me forget that this is a deserted island. I wonder if the children in my church in Greek are doing all right. I'm starting to miss them. Sure, it'll be okay. You're not a master master messenger quite yet, Pero. All right, repeat after me. Pick out your ear wax and listen. Pick ear wax and listen. You gonna do what I tell you or what? Gonna do what I tell you or what? <laughs> Great job. I bet Dougie will be so surprised. Oh dear. What sort of things are you teaching that bird? Wait, where, where's, where's the shoe bill? Hello? If it goes up here, I'm going to be somewhat surprised. It is not. Aha, there you are. I love warping, it's so fast. You want to try it, Mentor? Squaw. I have wings. I see, that's too bad. Squaw. Maybe it won't hurt to try it once. Ha, ah, you're so sweet. I love you. I have a single new fish. Ocean Guide is a gift. Lots of books. Lots of books. Rain. I don't. 
Defender and Gear Slot Plus One. Check the bulletin board. I'll spell the details since you came over to chat. I'd like both you and Saha to know about this. I understand why you called up Ado, but why me? Well, I wrote that I have another sworn enemy here besides the Oceanus. That sworn enemy is a fish. A fish? You mean like the one what got away? Haha, <laughs> something like that. It's a bothersome foe. I'd like you guys to defeat it for me. Sorry for taking something so silly so seriously. Yeah, haha, <laughs> don't sweat it. Only it won't do you any good. Now then, how big is this fish? What? Well, yes, well, this fish appears to be a breed of Piraru. But it's a giant one that's over five melee long. Hot damn, that's a crazy big one. Mm, it appears every so often without warning. Little Pero recently spotted it. If we don't catch it now, we might not get this chance ever again. Unfortunately, I don't have time to go out and fish it up myself. Which is why you're asking us. You're planning to eat this bad boy once you haul it in? Of course, you cook what you catch. That's the first rule of fishing. Now then, can I ask you to do me this favor, Adol? Would you like to see this fish? Haha, <laughs> your curiosity truly knows no bounds. Anyway, that fish is supposedly in a pond at the Water and Woods Hill. Memorials can be found there as well. Please be careful while you're there. Alright. Now the question is... Where... There. There you be. The Picard ran away. <clears throat> Get back here, you little twerp. There you are. Oh my! <clears throat> right into the fire he went. Guard doll. Oh. Ha. Huh? I've been bamboozled. Deceived. And quite possibly tricked. <clears throat> Get over here, you. Thank you, Adol. You've been a big help. Huh. This little fellow looks a little singed. Wonder what happened. Maybe it's clumsy. Hmm, I see. Every Picard has a different personality. That's what makes this so much fun. No, no. Uh, but that doesn't mean I actually like these guys or anything. I just can't ignore them is all. And taking care of them is really relaxing too. <clears throat> ah, when you actually think about it like that, they're actually helping me out. Hey, settle down. I'll feed you soon. Anyway, thanks a lot for your help today. Oh yeah, you should take some of the crops I harvested earlier. Egg, ten eggplants. 
Okay, I'm gonna get back to work. <laughs> I'll let you know if I need your help again. Mission complete. Great job. With the new Picard, the farm's productivity has increased. Cool. You've become quite the green thumb. Well, I do work at it every day. I don't like how dirty I get. But if I don't stay on top of this, everything gets messed up. <laughs> it's funny though. I'm actually enjoying myself right now. Same goes for the cards. They can't survive without me, you know. So I figured I gotta protect those guys, too. <laughs> <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. well, I, I'm just working the farm, that's all. Let me know if you guys have any problems, okay? I'm gonna be a real important big shot when I grow up. <laughs> You'll see. Yeah, he's a good kid. He's a good kid. Uh, let's see if I can't go fishing. <clears throat> Why is everything... Is it through here? Only one way to find out. <coughs> Me. Feels like there's something stuck in the very back of my throat. Oh, oh I remember this area. Three bitter remedies, don't mind if I do. So the giant nemesis is over that away. Well, oh, 56, huh? This place is just a little bit out of my level range. <clears throat> Ow. 
everything is pain. Shot master. Rapid thrust sparks. Ooh, Thunderclaw. Yeah. I'm getting nervous. It's here. This thing's big. Ooh, a treasure chest. There's an act jewel. Thunderclaw. Okay. Let's go. Ha! What is that thing? All right. What's biting today? Uh -oh. Ow! Yes. Stupid little piece of this area is much too high level for me. This isn't unless Trash! 
get out of here. Oh boy. <clears throat> oh boy. Oh boy. That's. I. My mashing thumb is tired. This is a giant Peraru that Thanatos told us about. Yeah, this that thing's ridiculous. Mother will be so happy. Peraru grew so large in the first place. I've never seen such a huge fish before. Oh, let's report to Thanatos at once. Alright Thanatos, we got your big fish. Let's feed it to the shoe bill. <laughs> oh, you reeled in my nemesis. Aha, great, let's cook this sucker up and have a feast. And so Adel brought back the giant Peraru. Nando's cooked a bunch of different dishes out of it. Despite the tremendous amount of food prepared, everyone managed to eat it all. Enjoy the food? Aha, <laughs> <laughs> glad you liked it. Heh, <laughs> it's nice to sit down with everyone and share a meal. Hmm, you look like you want to ask me something. We've broken bread together, so to speak. You can ask me anything. You have family besides Dakota? Hmm, a personal question, huh? The answer to that is no. For now, that is. Don't get the wrong idea, though. Nothing tragic has happened to any of my loved ones. I live the carefree life of an explorer. So I've never been able to settle in one place for very long. At my age, I have a lifetime of excuses for not settling down. Not to brag, but I used to do pretty well for myself back in the day. Even now, I still got plenty of lovers to choose from. <laughs> so, how are you doing in the romance department? <laughs> Don't get so flustered. You tell me about your conquest some other time. Genesis is complete. Phantom's rule was increased. And a hermit's remedy. And that is all the side quests, I believe. Is there anything else? No, nothing else that really needs to be doing. Although there is one thing. Alright. Let's see if I can remember where it is. No, not there. Was it here? I think it might have been here. Wait.
I don't know I was here. I was living in the wrong area. Also, Sahad, your services are not required at the moment. My turn now! Allow me! Finally, deal with this pest. Is mine. I claim this victory in the name of truth, justice, and the American way, or some such. And then I'm just gonna sit here and recover some HP. And then after that, actually, yeah. I should get moseying along with the MSQ. This is the aerial corridor. My time, this corridor was the entrance to the Royal Palace of Eternia. <coughs> oh, look over there. Huh, the crystal is glowing. Time to go back to the past. And in that case, this is probably a fair enough spot to end the episode. Since we are almost 35 minutes deep. be seeing things. The clouds are nowhere near the sun. Yes, of course. Now then, are you certain that the palace will cease to be? Yes. Sorry, and I have spent our entire lives in the capital. You can see why it's difficult for me to accept such a terrible thing will come to pass. Olga. I'm also concerned about that chasm. Why does that appear in the capit- Let's move it, people. We must finish before the day is done. Well, well, Lady Dana, I see. Accompanied by the High Priestess, no less. Are you headed into the city? I am, yes. I have business I must attend to there. Ah, I see. Please let us know if we can be of any assistance. Of course, thank you. Where are you and your men going? We are storing food by decree of Her Majesty Queen Sari. 
Lady Diana is said to have received a vision of a poor harvest this year. That vision came to her just yesterday. How impressive of Queen Ari to take action so soon. Yes. Yes, even if this year's harvest is poor, we have nothing to fear. The Kingdom of Eternia has faith in both Queen Sari and Lady Dana. After all, they have brought about the most prosperous age in Eternia's history. <laughs> well, we should return to our duties. Yes, forgive me for distracting you. Oh, this was no distraction at all. Please excuse us. I just couldn't tell him. I couldn't admit that I'm trying to figure out why the palace will vanish. It's fine, there's no reason to cause unnecessary confusion. Now then, Dana, we should be on our way as well. This man, Adol, was trying to reach the aerial corridor in front of the palace, yes? That's right, I need to hurry so Adol can reach the chasm. <sighs> Excuse me. And away we go. Maiden, High Priestess. What's wrong, Cecile? Are you two leaving so soon after the Harvest Festival has ended? You both seem rather preoccupied as of late. We really have us, but we'd rather not inconvenience anyone else with this. No, no, I'm sorry. I guess I'm not expressing myself clearly. What I mean is, if you need any help, you can come to us. I don't know what you two are so busy investigating. I can tell just by looking at you that it's something serious. I don't know what help we can provide, but please let us do whatever we can. Hmm. Thank you, Cecil. I'm very grateful for your offer. At the moment, we cannot share any details just yet, but when the time comes, I'm sure we will call upon you for help. And when we do, I trust that you'll provide all the help we will need. Lady Nana, I understand. Thank you. At the very least, allow me to handle things while you are away. Please do. Dana, let's part ways here for now. That way I can do some investigating of my own at the temple. Understood. I'll meet up with you as soon as I can. <laughs> the temple won't fall into ruin just because you two are away. The Harvest Festival just finished, so everywhere is crowded. Please be careful while you're out. May the Great Tree guide your path. Things do not go that smoothly. You know what? You know what? While I'm here, I'm going to end the episode here. And then when I come back next episode, I will. Excuse me. I will go down the path that the Virtue Gate has unlocked. And then continue on with the story. But until then, remember to like, comment, subscribe, ring the little name of the name if you be so kind, get off my lawn, you filthy casuals.